Hi, this is Roger from Kanker Labs and a short announcement about a uh, contest that is already running for one or two weeks, but you still can participate. It's about either building or showing us your frame antenna. I will come back to that uh, in a minute. Just as an introduction, you might have noticed when you have uh, visited our shop uh, that we uh, one thing so we specialize in is anything that has to do with radio reception. Uh, we have specialized uh, integrated circuits around that. We have antennas and we will expand our uh, program, our supply of anything around um, AM reception uh, just in, in the next few weeks. Um, you will know uh, the, the well-known ferrite rod uh, antennas. We have new ones or new old stock ones here for long and medium wave. But we also will take uh, these um, spider web uh, antennas for a long and medium wave. Um, we will supply loop antennas. I don't know if you have ever seen this one, but this is also a, an antenna. But what is uh, missing is uh, what we think is the king of all indoor reception antennas, and that is the frame antenna. Well, if you have never have heard of them, uh, just take a look at the link we um, will uh, supply down below. Um, the, a frame antenna, if it's built the right way, is, uh, is really the best antenna for indoor use. It just is not sensitive to all the electrical deter disturbances like, like EMI or RFI uh, emissions uh, from your switch mode power supply and anything else electronically today. Uh, it's only receptive for the magnetic uh, part of the electromagnetic uh, waves and um, you can build it uh, with extremely high figures of merit. Uh, you can um, get very high output voltages uh, if, if you build them the right way, but what is miss missing uh, on the market is just an easy to build kit. When you uh, search around uh, on the web, you uh, will uh, only find uh, one uh, time home built uh, frame antennas. And uh, many of the users just either don't have uh, the time or uh, the possibility uh, to build uh, one from scratch. So that's the, um, the aim of the uh, contest that we want to get inspired by you. Um, uh, just uh, we want to find out which is the uh, easiest way to supply a, an easy to assemble kit for a frame antenna of the highest uh, quality. Um, we even plan to build one uh, perhaps only with one or two windings for the shortwave um, range with a figure of merit in the range between two and five thousand. If you think that's impossible, we will teach you another uh, way that it really is possible. And so uh, the contest is still running for around uh, two weeks. Uh, perhaps we will prolong the the uh, um, the end time, uh, the deadline of of the contest still a little bit. And of course, uh, you can also win something. Uh, the best three entries uh, will get either one of our um, tube experimental kits or the, the you can um, uh, get um, things from our shop in, in this with the same amount of money as the um, equivalent of the tube experimental kits. Uh, so I hope uh, it's not too late uh, just uh, to publish this, uh, uh, this uh, contest here on YouTube. If you have any ideas, if you already have built a frame antenna, uh, just take a look. I'm, I'm sorry the um, contest, the description is, uh, is in German. Uh, because uh, the contest was called out from our master Burkhard Kainka, who 
only uh, publishes on his website in German. Uh, but you don't have uh, the, the links uh, that you can find in uh, the contest uh, homepage. Uh, they are more, many of them are in English and uh, picture says more than th a thousand words. Uh, so uh, you only have to look at how a frame antenna looks or look it up in the English Wikipedia. Uh, you, you can get a lot of information, but um, uh, really the purpose is uh, how to easily build uh, one uh, with uh, easy to get materials uh, that, that we really can supply an affordable kit for a frame antenna. Um, so that was it. Um, thanks for watching and uh, I hope you take part in uh, the uh, contest or uh, get inspired by, uh, by it. That was it for today. Thanks for watching. Bye from Kanka Labs. Bye from Roger.